Join your CBBC buddies as they take you on a wild and wacky tour around the USA. Ian invents his own soda pop. Oh. <laughs> Naomi rocks out with Doctor Who. Johnny visits London. And Richard feels the pinch. You don't want to give him to me. Virginia Beach, Virginia. Ed versus Richard! In the main event. Richard, why are you crouched behind the bins? It's not very glamorous behavior for a television presenter. Shh, I'm trying to catch a hermit crab. Catch a hermit crab? Today on Virginia Beach? That's impossible. Look, it's not impossible. Anyway, stop giving it all that. You see hermit crabs, right? They don't have their own shell. They move into other shells. Now, this one's lightweight. This one's perfect. This one's gorgeous. I think this is going to get me the winner. Yeah, yeah, but there's no hermit crabs on the beach today. They'll all be at the races. Oh, no! The races! That's where we should be! Quick, come on! Yes, Virginia Beach plays host to the event in the crab calendar, the Mid-Atlantic Hermit Crab Challenge. The hermit crab has no shell and uses empty shells it finds as its home. 300 elite racing hermit crabs strap on their Go Faster shells to compete in the Cross Station 500 each year. And with 10 claws each to scuttle around on, they should be pretty nifty. Or should that be nippy? <laughs> Run, boys! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I knew you were joking. I was playing along. Now go and look for some real crabs. Oh, wow, look at these guys. Are you racing these today? Yeah. Oh, that's so, you know. What are their names, then? That one's Hermie and that one's Toes. Is there not any danger they might fall out? No. no. They have claws that will hold them in. So how many you got in here? There's one. Five. One. There's five? So they're going to be competing in the race? Yes. Oh, look. <gasps> he's coming at me. Look at that one. Wow, he's got big eyes. So what have you been doing to train your crabs then? Just letting them run around. Yeah, we've just been letting them oh, go well, in and sleep, so they're ready for the race. So you've got lots of energy. Did you yeah. just get a little nip then? Um, yeah. Yeah, he pinched me. You don't get this problem with a gerbil. Yeah. OK, boys, time's ticking. Stop admiring other people's crabs and see if some nice person will let you borrow theirs for the race. So, what we got here? What's this crab's name? Blurp. Blurp? Ah, unusual. And how is Blurp? Is he a fast runner? Does he run a lot? Yes. He does? His name is Stripey. He used to have a shell with a stripe on it, so... Oh, and then he moved out? Yep. Oh, well, that's not much good, is it? You have to change his name. Have you done this before? Yes. OK, so, so what's the best kind of crab to go for for the hermit crab race? Um, a big one or a small one? One of my biggest ones last year and one of my smallest ones got to the semi-finals, so I don't really know. Oh. So, yeah. Mm. It's so hard to... This is an important choice I've got to make today, and I can't decide whether to go big or small. This is America. I'm going to go big. Ed has chosen Stripey, who will now be known as Eugene Bold. Weighing in at, well, not very much, favourite food, apples, cheese and meatballs. Wow, so you've actually got quite a nice crab here. What's his name? <gasps> you don't want to give him to me because he might, he might pinch me. I'm quite scared of him. So I'm looking for a champion today. Is this a champion crab? Yes? How do we know? How do we know it's going to be a champion um, crab? What's his name, first of all? Um, Body. Spotty. So how how comes Spotty's going to be a champion crab? Um, we practiced at home. You practiced at home? Uh, on our kitchen table, and yeah. he won a lot of times. He won a lot of times. Uh -huh. Oh, I, I think he might be the crab for me then. Richard has chosen Spotty, renamed Crab with Swag. Faster speed, not very fast. Special skill, climbing. Ah, uh, <laughs> got my crab. Yeah, so have I. My one's going to win, I think, Ed. Oh, no, 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 mine was a very careful interview process to find mine. And I've yeah, called him sure. Eugene Bolt. Well, yeah, I mean, Wasn't it Usain Bolt? No. No, I called him Eugene Bolt deliberately after my uncle Eugene. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Well, mine's going to win. Mine's called the Crab with Swag. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Trust me, this is the champion right here. He's just chilling in the palm trees, you know, kicking back, relaxing, getting ready yeah. for the race. This is the 10th year the event has been held and anyone can enter. If you don't have your own pet crab, you can buy one at a local shop. All the crabs start in the middle of the table. The first one to cross the red line is the winner. This is so weird. <laughs> no, apparently they're very sociable. They don't like being on their own. Come on, lads, get on with it. Let's chat more training. I get knocked down. Call yourself a crab, huh? Do you? Well, scientists don't. Yeah, you're not even a crab. You don't have your own shell. Yeah, how do you feel about that? I'm trying to get him riled up. It's part of the training. Pass them, move them legs! Move them! Come on! Look at your shell! It's cracked, it's got a hole in it! Oh, you're useless. You're meant to have swag. You've got no swag. You disgust me! I love you, really. Climb that hill! Climb that hill! You go! Go on! Climb the hill! That was a good session. Hit the showers. You're going to do this, man. Open up! Open up! It's there for you! I hope you haven't tired him out too much, Ed, because it's time for the big race. Come on! Wake up! Get your claws out and get your pincers at the ready. Let battle commence. Good luck, lads. Oh, explosive start from Swag. The new lightweight shell making all the difference, but Bolt just hasn't got the legs. Well, apart from 10. Come on, he's looking a bit sleepy. Mine's not doing very well, we've been staying in the red spot. Come on, Eugene, wake up! Start bolting! Oh, there we go, he's taking off. Oh, maybe I covered him in too much water, he's slippery. Oh, oh. Crab with swag's going. Oh, no, no, no. Eugene's just turned round. Eugene, what are you doing? Oh, it looks like Crab with swag is in the lead. Can Eugene Bolt claw it back? Doing? Go on. Oh, it's that shell. I should never put the one with a heavy shell. Oh, no. Crab yes. With swag, no. Yes. No. Yes. No. <laughs> I told you how you put swag on it, it's gonna win. Oh, mine got tired after lunch. Yeah. What position did mine come in? <laughs> Pretty close to last. Uh, guys, thank you so much for being with us here in Virginia Beach at the Mid-Atlantic Hermit Crab Challenge. Thank you. And uh, it, was a, it was a pleasure to watch you guys work and race. Now, yeah. unfortunately, there can only be one uh, winner of this. And it goes to Team Richard. Wicked. Absolutely. Thank you, Thank much, you so much. It was excellent. Cheers. Excellent. And you did a great job, but better luck it. next time. Don't touch me. I'm feeling crabby. You've been watching all over the place, USA.